Okay, boys and girls, uh, today we're going to take a look at um, a scientific principle that we are discussing today, which uh, we will get to in just a moment. But first, I want to show you a couple of demonstrations. Right here, we have some water in these beakers, and I have a plain old golf ball. And I think that you know what happens when a golf ball goes in the water. If you've ever seen anyone play golf before, I'm going to put the golf ball right here in that beaker of water, and it sinks, which is what we would expect. All right, there's nothing magical about the golf ball, nothing special about the water. Let me go ahead and take that golf ball out, and I put it right over here in this beaker of water. And for some reason, it does not sink, it floats. Well, you just saw that's the same golf ball, so why would it sink here, and why would it float right here? Or, let me show you something else. <clears throat> I have another beaker of liquid right there, and I have an ice cube, and this ice cube is blue, but there's nothing special about it. I promise you it's just water. I made it blue so that you can easily see it. Think about whenever you have some ice water or Coke or um, iced tea or anything. When you put ice in the beaker of water, what do you expect ice to do in water? Does it sink or does it float? Well, usually whenever we put an ice cube in water, it floats. Of course, it's turning the water a little bit blue, but I made it blue so that you can easily see it. Is that showing that it's floating? Mm -hmm. All right, so we have our ice cube floating there, and that's what we would expect. But when I put the ice cube over here in this beak, in this, in this beaker, we would think it would float, but that's not floating. It sank to the bottom. Now you saw it's the exact same ice cube. So what's going on there? Well, I'm going to go ahead and tell you that this liquid is not the same as this liquid, and this liquid is not the same as this liquid. They are different liquids, and this liquid is not the same as that liquid. They are different liquids, <clears throat> and that has to do with density. The ice cube is the same, the golf ball is the same, but the liquids are different. They have a different density, and so density is the concept that you're going to be learning about in today's lesson. If you have any questions after you go through the lesson, make sure that you contact your teacher. Make sure that you pay attention and understand what the definition and concept of density is.